that. <laughs> we are counting down to music's biggest night on Sunday, and all week we're traveling down the road to the Grammys. What she's feeling today it's her birthday happy birthday to you alicia keys 37 years old and still looking on fire she has sold more than 30 million albums worldwide and won grammy for songs like no one that you're hearing there fallen and empire state of mind her husband grammy award-winning producer is swiss beast swiss beats rather he's the man behind songs like kanye west ultralight beam Jay-Z's on to the next one, on to the next one, and Beyonce's Ring the Alarm. Tonight, the Recording Academy will honor the couple with the Producers and Engineers Wing Award. We sat down with them ahead of their big night for their first interview together. The two of you are together are receiving the Producer and Engineer Wing Award from the Recording Academy. This is what they said about why you're getting it, by the way. Swiss Beats and Alicia Keys set new precedents for excellence their contributions are paramount, that you two are an undeniable force in the industry. Mm. I like the sound of that. Mm. Yeah, that's, I like that, too. We are. Alicia started playing piano at seven, we know that. You started DJing in high school. So music has been a big part of your lives for a very long time. Absolutely. So what does it mean to you both as we sit here getting ready to celebrate Grammy weekend? Well, for me, it's, music is the instrument of life. I yeah. agree. I feel like music is the, it's the answer, it's the reason. It's so powerful. That's why we all love it. Yeah. That's why we can't live without it. It's like mm -hmm. Quincy Jones said, there's two things you can't live without, water and music. Yeah. And I was like, yes! We got way too much in common. Music is just one of the things that bond power couple Alicia Keys and Swizz Beats. He's one of hip hop's most critically acclaimed Grammy winning producers. She's released six studio albums. And even after 15 Grammy wins, she's focused on what's ahead. The best things that I've ever done is coming. Oh, really? Trust That's me. That's a real fact. Trust That's me. That's a real fact. <laughs> yeah. Kanye West said, you are the best rap producer in the business, he said. <laughs> you work with, with, with Beyonce and Jay and Metallica and Gwen Stefani yes. and Madonna. I mean, mm -hmm. so what do people get when they get Swiss Beats as their producer? So they get super honesty, a lot of challenges, a good time. You're going to get positive energy when, you, when you're in the studio with me. No, Alicia said, you know, he can work with anybody and he makes everything all right. I thought I that was a nice thing to it's say true. about him. It's <laughs> true. He really, he knows how to um, make you feel comfortable. What happens when you're working on music and he does something that you don't think is great or she does something <laughs> that you don't think is great? It's easy. Is it easy? Yeah, it's very hard for me to find something that she can't do great. Well, just that's suppose. Sweet, I mean, because everybody's true. going, Alicia, that's, that's great, great, great. Swiss, that's great, great, great. Oh, I told you. And you're the truth. sitting oh, there. Nah, saying, he's, a, he's, he's brutally honest. I'm like, babe, <laughs> could you like be a <laughs> little <laughs> sweeter with the way you gave that to me? Just a tiny. But this is the thing that I like about the two of you together because it does feel that you are each other's cheerleaders. But is there ever healthy competition between the two of you? Uh, you know, I, I would say no, because mm. I feel that one of the things that really works about us is we're very different. Even the style of music is different from my style of music. We complement each other mm. as opposed to kind of ever in each other's way right. or should they ever feel We're thinking, well, gosh, she did that, now I have to do this. We don't rock so, like that. Yeah, that's we a, don't. That's an unhealthy vibe for any couple. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of men are scared of powerful women, mm. right? And so... Mm. I know she's powerful. Her what? power doesn't scare you. No, mm, man. That's cool. I, it, I love it. Get it on the floor. Get it, get it on the floor. Yeah. Swizz recently moved beyond the studio. Last fall, he earned a degree from Harvard University's Owner President Management Program. It's an accomplishment that inspired him to create the motto From the Bronx to Harvard. Yeah, the number one thing that uh, people want to talk to me about now when I walk around is Harvard. A lot of people say, man, I, we, we graduated, you know, it's not like a me thing, it's a we thing. 
What did you think when he said this was what he wanted to do? Oh, I was so excited, and I've been so invested in this journey with him. For the first time, I'll never forget, we were literally in this room when he got the letter of acceptance. Mm -hmm. And it was like such a, a moment because it was so powerful, like this dream that he had to do this. By the way, in order to do that, there's a lot that's required to even be accepted. Yeah. He can't just be like, hey, yeah. I'm coming in. Yeah, yeah. Like, he can't be, I'm Swiss Beats mega no. producer. Yeah. No. 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 You, you have to be accepted. You, you know? got turned down three times? Yeah, the last oh, wow. time I was like, you know what? I've tried, you know, three <laughs> times. Maybe this is not for me. Bang. And, 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 and that's why you really can't ever give up. Ambition sure runs in the family. Alicia is stepmom to Prince, Kasim, and Nicole. Together, the two have three-year-old Genesis. Hey. And seven-year-old Egypt. He made headlines at five years old when he created an original beat yeah, yeah. for Kendrick Lamar. Young Egypt. He didn't know who Kendrick was. He just <laughs> seen him and was attracted to his light. Yeah. And when, yeah. hey, how you doing? I'm Egypt. We, you know, uh -huh. he's telling What's Kendrick, your name? Yeah, yeah, he's telling Kendrick about music. Yeah, he's like, you, you know, know what that is? You know what guitar that is? That's electric. <laughs> you hear that? That's a piano. I play piano. Like, he's uh -huh. just like finding his way with Kendrick and it was epic. Mm. And then he comes up with a beat for him and Kendrick ends up using it. Yeah. Actually. I don't even have a track on Kendrick's album. I, I was jealous. <laughs> And that this will be my last serious. question, Alicia. Before you came, we were talking about kids. And I said, don't we want a baby, Alicia? And he said, yes. Ah! <laughs> so what does mommy Alicia say? That would make me what so happy. What like that for? You know you want a girl. I, it, it would be that would a make blessing. Not right now. It would be wonderful. Trust me, you don't need one, another one right but now. But you got to talk to the universe. Universe, yeah. But I'm not ready right now, universe. Hear me loud right. and clear. Same here. Right, we're not ready. <laughs> But you are open to a baby, Alicia. It would be pretty unbelievable. Oh, I know. That would make me so happy. It, Just think about that. It would be pretty think about that. Universe? All right. Universe? All right. They've been, been together eight years. They said in that time they've never had a serious ar argument, wow. that they've never raised their voice, that when they have conflict, they sit down. They all, Everybody says communication, but these mm. two really do communicate. So I'd like to talk to you about something. I thought that was interesting. And the Harvard Business School now wants to do a case study on the two of them together. Ooh, I like which that. I think is very, very, very cool. Wow, from student, from, yeah, from student to case study. Yeah. From the Bronx to student to case study. That's exactly that's... what happened. So congratulations. It is her birthday today. She yeah. turns 37. Great interview, Gail. Uh, I really like them both so yeah. much. So congrats, congrats.